So today's Gotcha Club mini movie is called The Last Alpha Mark and this story is by Angel and Stella Studio. So I will have the original in the description down below and let me know what other gotcha stories you'd like to see me react to next. Ever since I can remember, I've always lived by my parents' rules. Oh sure, that sounds completely normal since every normal kid is like that, but I guess you could say I'm not normal. I'm a prince. And for my whole life, I've never had even a minute to myself. It was always balls, parties, feasts, and everything else in between. And also, it wasn't me who got myself ready for all these parties and stuff. It was the maids and all of the people in the castle. And it isn't just parties they helped me get ready for. It's everything. And that's why I've never even had a minute to myself. Oh, sure, I like being a prince. But I think it's about time I have a break from it. But when I asked my parents, if I could go somewhere on my own, of course they said no. So I'm taking matters into my own hands. Your Highness, are you completely sure about this? Positive. I can't stay here any longer. I want to see the world. All right, but be careful, Your Highness. That was Sarah, a castle maid. And yes, she is a wolf. Wolves are disliked by many people, including my parents. But I don't dislike wolves. In fact, I feel as though I have a strong connection to them. Well, it's getting late. All right, I'll I'll head into town and get a place to stay for the night. Then in the morning, I'll head out again. Lucas got a room at a nice hotel, and he stayed there for the night. Meanwhile... Where is my son? Uh, I don't know, your highness. We haven't found him. Well, look harder. His future queen was supposed to come today, and now because of this delay, we have to cancel until my son returns. Find my son! Now! Yes, your highness. Phew, it's morning. Finally, I don't have to wake up to a bunch of talking and activity that usually went on in the castle. Well, time to head out again. Oops, I think I took a wrong turn. You're staying here. No, please, master. I have nowhere else to go. Please. Be quiet and don't follow me. Master, no. Wait. Don't follow him. Huh? What? Why not? He's just going to push you away again. But I need him. I don't have anywhere else to go. Well, if you want, you could be my traveling companion. I could use the company anyway. What? You want me to be your traveling companion? But I'm a wolf. Yes, I can see that, but I don't mind. Well, if you insist. Thank you so much. All right, let's get going. But wait, you haven't told me your name. Oh, it's Lucas. What? But that's the prince's name. Yeah. <gasps> you are the prince. Shh. I don't want anyone else to recognize me. I think I heard something over there. Oh, no. It's time to leave. Let's go in here. All right, the coast is clear. Why were we running? The guard was trying to find me to take me back to the castle. Does that mean you ran away? Not really. I was going to go back when I was ready. Well, I can tell you don't really want to talk about this, so... Instead of talking about it, I'll tell you my name. Or at least the name I had before I was taken away from my family. They took your name? name away? Yeah, kind of. But anyway, my name is Amara. Or was Amara. Nice name. Thanks. Well, anyway, we should probably stay the night in this cave just to make sure the coast is clear. All right, your highness. Oh, you can just call me Lucas. Thank you for being my first ever friend. After that, the two settled into the cave for the night. And later that night... <sighs> Why do I feel so tired? Guess I'll just wake Amara up. Hey, Amara? Uh, what? How did you sleep? I slept pretty well, actually. How about you? Uh, not really sure. All I know is I'm kind of tired. Oh, I'm sorry you didn't sleep well. This actually happens to me almost every night. Well, anyway, we should probably head out now. Maybe you can get some new clothes. What? I couldn't have heard that right. Did you say new clothes? B -b -b why would you want to get me new clothes? Because you're my friend. You said so yourself. Yeah, I did. Thank you, Lucas. You're welcome. Um, hello? Hello, how can I help you? Uh, huh? What happened? Well, you see, I'm... No time for explanations. We need to fix you up. Please, come with me. Good, I don't think she saw my face. A little while later. So, what do you think? Um, you look, uh, beautiful. <gasps> Thank you. Well, anyway, are you getting new clothes? Uh, no, I wasn't planning on it. Aw, come on. Oh, 
All right. But just one thing. Later. All right, I think we're done here. All right, that will be $142. What? Amara, what did you buy? Oh, nothing. Well, whatever. Here you go. All right. Do you think maybe you could rent an apartment or something? Then I can show you all the surprise outfits I got you. Amara, I said I only wanted one thing. Oops. Amara, get back here. At an apartment? So, what do you want me to try on? You actually want to try them on? Not really, but if it's for you, I'll make an exception. Thank you, Lucas. Ooh. Hmm. <laughs> Whoa. I think I'll leave this one on. You actually like it? <laughs> hey, why are you laughing? You're just so funny when you don't want to admit you like something. I like that about you. Uh, I like you too, Amara. No, I meant I only like that one thing about you. So you d don't like me? Of course I like you, silly. I was just joking. Later that night. <sighs> I can't sleep. This will get off. What? Is that you, Lucas? <gasps> Samara, you are correct. I am a wolf, and this is an alpha mark. What? B but how? Well, this alpha mark is extremely powerful. After all, it is the last alpha mark in existence. But if this is the last alpha mark in existence, then how did you get it? And how are you a wolf? Well, I wasn't born a wolf. The mark turns me into one. Every night, around midnight, the mark appears to me in my dreams. Then, it transforms me into a wolf. But why haven't you told me this? I haven't told you this because I don't remember ever being a wolf during the day. Huh? Why don't you remember? It's a test the mark gave me. If I can remember being a wolf without anyone telling me, I can keep the mark and being a wolf all the time and not just at night. <gasps> this is amazing, Lucas! Yes, and I want to tell you, during the day, do not tell me that I became a wolf at night or I will lose the mark forever and it will choose someone else. If you can promise me that you'll keep this promise, I will not erase your memory this night. You can erase memories? Yes, it's one of my powers I got from this mark. Now, do you agree? Yes, Lucas. During the day, I won't tell you that you're a wolf. Thank you, Amara. I knew I could trust you. After that, Amara got to know two sides of Lucas. The day side of Lucas when he is not a wolf, and the night side of Lucas when he is a wolf. Has my son been found? Uh, no, your highness. No, but it's been nearly a week and still nothing. Well, sir, someone told me when I was asking around that they thought they saw him with a wolf girl with brown hair. A wolf girl? I don't want him to be with some wolf girl. All right, this is the last straw. I think it's time that I hire the Black Flames for this job of finding my son. But sir, they're dangerous. I know that, and I also know that they're wolves just like you. But they'd be more capable than all of you guards. Soon my son, you'll return, and you will marry Charlotte. Oh, Lucas, what should we do today? Try our best to avoid guards. But that's what you want to do every day. Also, we're in here. No guards are going to find us. Well, you never know. Why don't you want to go back to the castle anyway? Well, I needed a break from being a prince for a while. And since my parents wouldn't let me have one, I ran away. So, does that mean you're not going back? No, I was planning to eventually go back. Yeah, and... And when is eventually? Uh, I don't know. I just don't want to get dragged into meeting some girl again. Oh, I'm sorry, Lucas. Well, anyway, Lucas, I think I'll go for a walk. Would you like to come with me? Mm, I think I'll just stay here to avoid guards. Brothers, we received this letter from the king. What does that wolf hater want? Now, brother, don't be so harsh. Let our brother speak. The king wants us to find his son. His son, huh? Interesting. The little prince ran away. Well, I don't blame him. That king can be a real mean dude. Well, so are we. We'll find the little prince for the new good king, but in return, the prince will have to join our group. Good idea, brother. I always thought that the prince smelled like a little wolf-like. Maybe he's hiding something. Oh, one more thing, brothers. It says he was seen with the wolf girl. Oh, 
We could use her as bait. Alright, the plan is set. I can't wait to have a new member in our group. Phew, it's so nice to be out in the fresh air. I just wish Lucas could have come out here with me. Uh, it's alright, I understand. <laughs> Excuse me, but do you know where the prince is? Who wants to know? Don't be feisty, we don't want to hurt you. I'm not telling you anything! Well, I guess we have no choice then. Brothers, I think she's waking up. Yes, you're right, brother. <laughs> What's going on? Where am I and who are you? We are known as the Black, Black Flames. The, the Black Flames? Oh, so you heard of us? No wonder no one came to help me. Everyone is terrified of you. Even humans who normally look down on us wolves. Yes, now speaking of humans, we're looking for your human friend, the prince. I'm not telling you where he is. Well, you don't need to, because he'll come to us to save you. Don't be so sure. Mara sure is taking a while. Guess she's just enjoying nature. I'll go look for her if she's not coming back soon. But for now, I feel pretty tired, like always. Guess I'll take a quick nap. Where am I? Inside your dreams, silly. Huh? Who said that? Me. I did. But you look like me. That's because I am you. But I don't have wolf ears and a tail. Huh? Whatever you say, me. I'm just here to tell you that Amara's in danger. What? Amora? It's time, me. It's time for you to remember your life as a wolf and transform into me forever. What happened? Wait! I remember. I'm a wolf! Finally! I'm a wolf forever! Now it's time to go save Amora. I want Lucas to come, but then again I don't. Because if he does come, he'll be forced to go back to the castle. But if he doesn't, who knows what they'll do to me? Amora! Lucas? You shouldn't be here, Lucas. Amora, I'll be fine. Hey, Lucas, they'll take you back to the castle. Don't worry, Amora. I finally remembered who I really am. What? Enough chit chat. You're coming with us. Don't be so sure. What? Weren't you over there? Brothers, take a closer look at him. He's a wolf, but the prince isn't a wolf. He's human. I'm an alpha. Get it right. An alpha? But those don't exist anymore. Well, this one does, and this alpha is going to face his fears head on. I'm going to have a chat with my parents. What? Are you sure, Lucas? I'm done hiding, Amara. It's time I face my fears. I'm proud of you, Lucas. Father? Mother? Lucas, is that you? Yep. Lucas! Wait a minute. Are you a, a wolf? Yes. Yes, I am. But how is this possible? I'm not here to tell you how I'm a wolf. I'm here to tell you that I will not marry any girl you're most likely going to set me up with. I'm already in love with another girl. Don't tell me it's a wolf. And so what if it is? She and all the other wolves have feelings, same as us. You have to stop treating them like garbage. Uh, I don't know what to say. Say you'll stop treating us wolves as less than anything else. And you will stop forcing me to marry other girls of your choosing. Son, you'll make a fine king when you get older. Even as a wolf. Yes, and I always knew that. Lucas told his parents the story of how he became a wolf. He even told the story of how he and Amara met. So everything's alright now? Yeah, with wolves and humans. But there's still something else that's been nagging at me. Oh, and what's that? <sighs> I love you, Amara. I love you too, Lucas. The end. Oh my gosh, that was the last Alpha Mark a Gotcha Club mini movie by Angel and Stella Studios. That was so sweet. Definitely check out the original. I will have it in the description down below and support their channel so that they can continue making amazing stories. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a like. And if you're new, subscribe to come here, Mermaid or Merman. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.